We will color correct a shot in the timeline using a color corrector soft effect. This time, choose the standard player from the source area layout. Timeline effects are applied and previewed directly to the timeline and can be rendered at a later stage. Select the shot number 3, sandals left, on the timeline. The soft effect menu is available on the left side of the timeline. Click the CC button to activate a color corrector for the selected shot. The LED on the CC button turns blue to indicate that the effect is active. Click the yellow A button to disable the toki so that the effect is not animated. Click the E button to access the color corrector menu. This is the color corrector. From this interface, you can also access the color warper, which is the smoke advanced color corrector. Click the CC button to switch to the color warper menu. Enhance this image using the color warper. Drag the black slider towards left and make sure that you get nice deep blacks without losing too much details. Then, drag the white slider to the right to boost the highlights and increase the contrast. Drag the saturation slider slightly towards the right to make the colors more vibrant. Click on the warp button to switch it to gamma. Tweak the gamma curve to bring it up slightly. The gamma changes the luminance of the midtones without affecting the black point or the white point. You can experiment with your own settings if you want, and once you're happy with the result, press the exit button to return to the timeline.